Hello, David Kuby and Bear Woods Photography. So I put out a video last week uh, doing the unboxing and some fun stuff in the Tetons with the new Tamron 17-70 to uh, F2.8 DI3-A, which is the new lens that's designed for the Sony crop sensor system. It's got VC and it's uh, the RXD, the, the Rapid Extra Silent Drive. So today I wanted to do a little video, as promised, just to sort of show the difference in the video uh, VC, the vibration compensation. I'm going to do some four segments of video, four little clips. I'm going to be walking up a little, uh, little pathway to this overlook here. And um, that's going to be on the A6300 and then in the A6600, and it's a little bit of rain, so I've got some rain in my, uh, my glasses here. Um, so what I'm going to do is the first segment is going to be with the 6300 with vibration compensation off. The second one will be with the A6300 with vibration compensation on. Now the difference is the 6300 does not have in-body stabilization. So the vibration compensation is relying solely on the lens itself. With the 6600, I'll also do those same things, vibration compensation off and vibration compensation on. The 6600, however, has in-body stabilization. So the AI technology that Tamron has in this lens with the vibration compensation utilizes both the vibration compensation of the lens and the image stabilization in the body itself and it gives you a much smoother video when you're hand holding. So I'm going to do this four segments uh, and at the end I'm just going to say goodbye um, and I'm going to leave it up to you. I'd love to hear your comments. Go ahead and leave those below. So here we go. Very, very simple idea behind the test. Um, I want to leave it to your interpretation. Um, I can clearly see a difference. Uh, it, it's, it's very, very steady when you're using both the image stabilization inside the camera and in the lens itself. It makes a huge difference to me. Um, you know, just fantastic. The technology that's gone into this is just, just perfect. So do, do me a favor, go ahead, leave your comments below. Um, if you like the video, uh, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber to my YouTube channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down there as well. Uh, hopefully we'll see you soon. I'm going to get out and shoot this, uh, this lens some more in the near future. Looking forward to seeing you. Thank you.